right there on top of the moon. We could sit and do nothing. I wish we were both to just fly away. I don't. Well, what a miserable morning. Hey, welcome back to my channel. It is Gemma, if you are new to my channel, and it is the 17th, 17th of February. It's Thursday, and it's a good Thursday for me because it means no more get ups for school. I'm still working, but no more get ups for school. So there's no mad rush, which is really good because they're off for a week and they're off for inset day tomorrow. And looking at the weather, I don't want to be doing any school runs in this anyway. Um, so I'll be showing you what I eat for 1,400 calories. I'm also doing intermittent fasting. Um, my fasting window does change slightly dependent on what time I go to the gym. Um, so today I'm at the gym five while six, so my eating window will be to about half six, seven. Um, but I'll not be until at least 12, so we'll see how I get on. Uh, but it's going really well so far. I feel good. I'm enjoying it. I'm weaning myself off Diet Coke as well. I've been having one a day, so I'm having one today and then that's it. So hopefully that'll go well. Um, I'm trying to get my 10,000 steps in today obviously the weather's bad so i'm not going to get my morning walking but i am going to club size tonight all being well so i will let you know if i can hit that so it is nearly eight o'clock now i'm gonna go and drop our alex off at school get kayla sort of breakfast get kayla to school and then i'm gonna nip to tesco before i log on for work so i'll catch up with you in a bit well it's cooking again i've got one sausage in that i've put on for 10 minutes when it gets to six minutes i'm gonna pop the bacon and the mushrooms in I'm not adding any oil at all. And the egg, I could add the egg. You would take bottom out, but it's just messing about. Or I could put it in whole and air fry it, but I want a fried egg. So I'm just going to fry it in fry light. So I'm going to wait for it to get to six minutes and then add the bacon. So we've got 10 seconds left. I'm going to open it, give my sausage a shake. <laughs> that sounds so wrong. I'm give my sausage a shake and add my mushrooms and my bacon so like I said yesterday you just pull it out that's the sausage and I'm gonna add in the bacon no idea what this is gonna turn out like oh sizzling uh, don't fold over Mr Bacon it'll be cooked before I've closed it Pull that sausage to there, put them in. Let's see how these turn out. I have no clue. All right, so that's how I've placed them. We'll see how they turn out, shall we? Six minutes, so I'll catch up with you in six minutes. So it's just finished. So the sausage has had 10 minutes, the bacon and the mushrooms have had six. Yeah! They're perfect. Right, I'm going to plate these up. I'll catch up with you in a second. So here it is for 385 calories, all cooked within 10 minutes. Marvellous. I've decided to have chocolate wheat bix and milk um, instead of snack today. So in effect, it is my snack. I have put in a sweet clem as well, which I'll be having in the afternoon. I've just not got it out yet. Um, I'll pop the calories up on screen. And I'm having this because I'm going to gym between five and six. So I just want something to fill me up and sustain me for a little bit longer. So I thought if I have this, it's got fibre, it's filling. And at least I've got my calcium as well. And it's still something sweet. Oh, me and Kayla have just arrived. body combat. I'm only at 5,945 steps because I've slept. There's been no school run today. So hopefully it'll take up to near 10,000. I'm back from um, Body Combat. Kayla did fabulous again. I'm on 9,583 steps, so definitely a 10,000 step goal. Cracking on with tea. My eating window is till 7 o'clock. I'm going to be just out of it just because I'm in a rush. Um, Steve's been working away, only got back today, so he's not been able to do tea because I wasn't very organised with what I'd got. Um, I've got the Ninja on. I've set I can't know if you can see. I've got breaded mushrooms in one and homemade chips. I am going to calorize, I don't know if that's a word, but my chips are a little bit different because 
The first time I did them, I used the raw weight. I'm gonna use the cooked weight this time. Um, and what I've done is the oil that I've used, I've divided by the five people that these chips are gonna go between. So I've added the oil separately. Um, yeah, so we'll see how that goes. Bread and mushrooms are way cooked. The broccoli, I have weighed raw and the chickens I'm not going to weigh because they're birds I um, they tend to be all the same anyway um, so yeah I'll work out calories after and I will show you but I'm really hungry now um, looking forward to snaffling this food and then I'm going to get a nice shower and I won't mind a read tonight kids are off school tomorrow so there's no rushing about in the morning I'm still working but um, but yeah they're off so yay <laughs> so I'm gonna catch up on YouTube get dinner done and I'll catch up with you in a bit this is tea for 594 calories I'll pop the breakdown on screen so this is what I'm finishing my day with it's 111 calories I'm half an hour outside my eating window but I'm not concerned a little bit under calories really enjoyed tea it was lovely the bread and mushrooms and the chips were really nice done in the ninja I'm still not sure whether it's as good as an active fry yet the verdict is out but it's very very convenient with it having two um dual aspect kind of cooking so yeah anyway i'm going to pop my calories up on screen i'll pop the nutritional information um and i'll pop my step count so thank you for watching i will um be filming what i eat in a day tomorrow and then um, we've got something going on at the weekend, which I will explain more on Saturday.